In action, I'm going to discuss about how to connect Microsoft SQL Server with Visual Studio using OLE TV. So if I go on this control panel and uh, right there, press M, then you can see here Microsoft OLE TV driver for SQL Server that already installed. So this must be there. Then you can easily connect with the uh, SQL Server using Visual Studio. So the next is let's open there Visual Studio and here you can create the app or or this then the first is let's go on this tools connect to database and click on this change by default SQL Server that selected. So this selected here, Microsoft SQL Server SQL Client. So you need to click on this change, click on this other, and here you need to select .NET Framework Data Provider for ODBC, OLEDB, this all. Let's select here OLEDB. Then after, click on this OK. And here, you need to select Microsoft OLEDB driver for SQL Server. This you need to select. This place you need to give the server name or file name. So let's give your server name local host and connecting with the SA. So give your SA user and give the password. After that, if I open this place, SSMS SQL Server Management Studio. So SQL Server Management Studio, let's give the password and click on this connect. Now click on this plus and here add them and now tables. So this all tables that's present inside the SSMS. Now here you need, when you click on this initial catalog and if you fill this all detail, then you can uh, select the database this place. And after all uh, doing this all, let's click on this test button. Now you can see here test connection succeeded. And now let's click on this OK. So here you can see this is that's come there. MS OLEDB SQL localhost Adam that's come there. So whatever the tables that's present inside this SSMS. This all comes inside there. After that, let's right click. Then you can click on this retrieve. And when I click on this new query, then you can select here different tables. Let's add here. You can add the tables that place. Then you can see this all that's come there. Okay. And after that, the next is from this place you can get your new query properties you can get. So this is how we can easily connect SQL Server to Visual Studio using OLE TV. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.